We're out here miring our shredded area. But today is the start of something big. We have our first guest out to the ranch. Uh, we had some YouTubers spend the night, the last two nights out here. They're spending the night again tonight. But we also have kind of you guys out here. The public is out here. We have like 20 something guys showing up just volunteering to come help us clean, which is so cool. So appreciate all you guys for submitting. Um, sorry we didn't uh, get you here. We try to pick people that are close to here just because I didn't want people to like have to drive too far for this. Like they're gonna work hard today, but really appreciate everyone who is coming out today. You guys are awesome. And we are going to work hard in the Texas heat this morning and this afternoon, trying to get one thing on the resort cleaned up. It's gonna be quite the day. our friends at Heatwave sent glasses for every single person here. So big shout out to Heatwave. Use code DEMOMAT10 for a discount. Link in the description below. This is actually going way faster than I thought. We're like an hour in and this place is looking half cleaned out. Which is great, these guys are working hard. I also was wondering if we're gonna find a wine cellar in here, because there's apparently a wine cellar. But I thought maybe once we get all the rubble cleared out, we'd see like a passageway down. Nothing yet. Let's keep our eye peeled. Hopefully Jenna doesn't fall down the wine cellar. She'll never leave. Yeah, that would be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give this to Mary. She might wanna she might wanna save it. Here's a drink for you to cool off with, babe. I think you might wanna save that. She breaks everything. <laughs> All right, we're gonna take a little break to introduce you to our first guest. So they stayed in the Purple Door House for the last two nights. Um, and I told them that if they got this thing running, they could have it. So this thing I think was running when it was parked back in like 2004 or something, like almost 20 years ago, but hasn't ran since. So we got Junkyard Digs and Pole Barn Garage. I got it right, right? The classic. Nail gels channels. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I was talking, I've, I've talked to Kevin for a long time. Um, about doing some kind of collab. And then I bought this place and I was like, I got the perfect thing for you. <laughs> and so he came out here and he's been working on this thing for a couple days and how is it? The um, vans, we're getting there. <laughs> we've, we've already dropped the tank and fixed a hole in it and replaced the fuel pump, but our replacement fuel pump's bad. So That's now there's fun. a big hole. No, it's extra bad. It's real bad. There's a lot of gas fumes in this fan right now. It feels pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> My body feels great right now. <laughs> How was y'all's stay in the house? It was an experience. Any critters? Not nope. in it, no. The good. Inside the house was great, actually. We've got it. We, we made some modifications. I hope that's okay. Oh, we'll check them out. Yeah. We put an extra light up, found a little TV and some VC Fixed gauges. golf cart. Fixed yeah, golf these cart. guys got a golf cart running. They went in the barn, they went and bought a bunch of batteries and. We got a new golf cart. We still gotta do the paint job on it. Oh, I can't wait to see what you have planned for that. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, I hope you guys are enjoying your stay here. Please yeah. leave us a five-star review on Yelp. You'll get at least two. There'll be a, Good. There'll be a review. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the service out here hasn't been the best. Uh, the house is great, but I, got, I didn't get to the everything else, however. Yeah, <laughs> it's uh. There are lots of resources though. It's a work in progress. Yeah, he's he's like found a bunch of random parts just in the sheds to do tools. stuff with. Yeah, yeah, tools, the light, he mounted a light on the side of the house 
just so he could work outside and he found the light out in one of the sheds. It'll all be on, we're, we're shooting a video of that actually. Of cool. Of our stay here, the first guest at Matt's Haunted Resort. <laughs> Wait, the goat I didn't range. know it was haunted. Is it haunted? Well, that or it's just the 800 goats. Yeah. yeah. Probably the goats. There's you a lot of goats. I believe how many goats are here at night. Like, <laughs> right here like herds. At night. <laughs> I believe it by the amount of poop that is on the ground everywhere. <laughs> well, evidence glad y'all are here. Uh, if you need anything, I'm shoveling um, goat poop and ashes out of the building over there. If you hear the van go boom, uh, just, maybe just you know, just ignore just it. Stay it away. Fine, yeah. If y'all die, you won't be able to leave me a good review on Yelp. Oh, you're right. First oh. and last <laughs> guest. <laughs> yeah, we, we're closed down instantly. <laughs> sleeping there. Out. I knocked the entire front beam out, all the pillars on the front, the giant I-beam is laying on the ground and the house still didn't fall over. Now that's what I call demolition ranch. Goat poop really helps them lubricate on the spin. It just like slides it around in there. So actually it's, it's great. Look, they got that golf car running. Look at that. About manual labor what you know we, we work hard and like you really find out about yourself a lot and what I found out is I hate this <laughs> so it says Guadalupe Ranch we opening it I don't know let's open is it. it soap no it's cards oh it's like a uh, like coupons or something huh let's see what it says oh, it is. oh it's stickers just... How are they oh no they're just like notepads but they're not stickers they are stickers. Oh, they are stickers. <laughs> They're just They're real stickers. old and don't work anymore. Uh, yeah, we got a little sticker. I bet they would put it on something and write maybe names. Name tags. Everyone get a name tag. Hi. You working? Like so hard. I've never worked this hard before. Hey, you drop some stuff. Just don't litter, okay? Woo! Come here. Come here. Come here. 
Mayor, Mayor. Uh, so I found these guest evaluations. Just gonna have After everybody right. leaves, before they leave, they gotta fill them out, especially this part. What does that say? What needs improvement? <laughs> I can do a rainbow star or, yeah, we need to do animal. Mikey is gonna be. I'm in line, Jim. I get behind. Whichever, whichever animal I flip to is what Mikey's getting. <laughs> L, L dog. <laughs> You're gonna look great. Oh yeah, here's our rates, David. So the room that was above the reception, which is this, it was here, was $114 a night. Holiday rates, $139. So the purple door cabin, where uh, Junkyard Digs is staying, $184 a night. Uh, but holiday rates, $209 a night. Yesterday was Memorial Day, so I'm gonna go ahead and charge him the holiday rates. Let's go talk to him about this. Uh-oh, run. Hey guys, uh, y'all been here for two nights so far, right? Yep. How many more nights do you think you're gonna be here? Hopefully none. <laughs> uh, yeah, I prefer none. Well, okay. Your checkout was at 11. Y'all are still here, so I'm gonna have to charge you at least one more day. Uh, yesterday was uh, Memorial Day, as you guys know. It's a holiday. So holiday rates for the Gate College Cottage is $209. So you guys owe us 600 bucks. Um, Can we wait. work it off? Hey, uh, mm, I'll trade you a golf cart. You got the sweet golf You got yourself a deal. This ranch is paying off already. We found a tutorial on payroll. Uh, he found it, but I'm not paying any of these guys. <laughs> <laughs> There's what it used to look like. You can see the chimneys and everything. I don't think he made it out. This is the, my oldest employee. Oldest and best. Got some readers. Oh, oh my. Got some readers, yep, yeah. UPS. <laughs> is it open? Yeah. UPS right there. He looks so much smarter with one. You do look Thank smarter. You. Mayor! 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 Hey, Mayor, I um, just made an unfortunate discovery. Uh, I found I found their budget. Um, looks like they, were, they, losing they were losing money every year. Uh, there's, like right here, it starts out not too bad, like negative 500, negative 173, um, negative 1,027. But then you get back to this page, uh, negative 10,000. That's month to date. Year to date, negative 194,000. Um, negative 59,000, negative 1.2 million. I don't know what that means, but. I'm just gonna walk away now. I've made a terrible mistake. It's this one that really has me worried. The year to date, negative 1.2 million dollars. We're gonna need to turn that around. Luckily, I'm not paying any of these guys. <laughs> Look how much fun they're having, though. I want you guys to notice every time Jenna comes out to do hard work, she always wears white tennis shoes. She'll never learn. They're still white. It's because you're not doing that much work. I. Yeah. Hey. Compare that to Mikey's shirt. The hardest worker I've ever Mikey seen. Mikey rolls around on the ground. It's like. Oh well, yeah, he does roll around on the ground, but he also work. Look how hard he's working right now. Mikey. <laughs> oh, he the mullet. Mikey. 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 Jump. 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 <laughs> Now we can get skid steers in there and get everything clean. So thank you guys all for coming. Y'all are awesome. And if you guys want, since we're done way early, you guys can go hang out the river for a couple hours. So we got a, we got a nice little spot mowed down there. You guys are welcome to drive down there. If you have a truck, I would say maybe a car, you probably shouldn't go down there yet. We don't have it that great, but if you guys wanna go hang out the river, you can. Um, thank you, y'all are awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Jim Alicia. And you can come back tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day. <laughs> so literally everyone left, and then Donut and Brandon showed up. We're just glad to be a pivotal part of this experience. They said they were coming to help. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what I wanted to do today was this. Literally into the day. But they, <laughs> they brought white claws, so hey, all is good. well. All is well. <laughs> Made up for yeah, it. But they always bring white claws. That's, that's true. <laughs> we know when they show up, there will be white claws. <laughs> Uh, so now, um, I think we're going to end this episode here. We got to get a bobcat in there and just clean up all the junk. Uh, but it was like not really manpower work. It's just a bobcat. We need to just get it and dump it in the dumpster. And then uh, we're going to start trying to figure out what we can do with this now that we have it kind of cleaned out. It's going to be great. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching this episode of Renovating an Abandoned Resort. We'll see you next time. I love you.